patient has come with uh, swelling in the, the thyroid uh, in, in his neck for the past three months. Examine his neck and uh, discuss the diagnosis with the examiner. Okay. Most probably in the thyroid, there won't be any diagnosis, no swelling, nothing, only the tremors will be there. If the patient, if the examiner asks about the positive findings, just tell about the findings. Like I, I could appreciate only the tremors, I couldn't appreciate this, 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 this thing, everything. Whichever negative findings for thyrotoxicosis. Examine the thyroid gland and uh, look for signs of uh, thyrotoxicosis. So, this is my GMC number. So, I proceed with the task. Hello, Mr. Vishal. I am Dr. Mohan, one of the doctors in this department. I am here to examine your neck. For the purpose of examination, you need to undress about the waist, or about the movement arms, and ensure adequate privacy. Ask my examiner if I need the chaperone. Is that okay? During the examination, I will be verbalizing my findings to the examiner. So, kindly hear with me. My patient is normally dressed, uh, his weight seems to be normal. Uh, could you please raise your hands <coughs> like this and stretch your fingers? I could appreciate fine tremors. Uh, I couldn't appreciate any clubbing. I couldn't appreciate any pallor or any coiled neck here. Could you please turn your hands? Thank you. Uh, I couldn't appreciate any abnormal sweating or any palmar erythema. Uh, ideally, I will be looking for the pulse rate for one minute. Uh, the pulse rate is normal in my patient. 15 seconds. The pulse rate in my patient is 68 beats per minute. Uh, ideally, I should have measured the blood pressure as well. I couldn't appreciate any alopecia. Uh, could you please look up? Could you please look down? I couldn't appreciate any pallor or any ictus. There is no per periorbital swelling. Could you please protrude your tongue for me and hold it a bit? Thank you. Could you please roll it back? And could you please stick out your tongue? Roll it back. Thank you. I couldn't appreciate any sinuses. I couldn't appreciate any swelling uh, on protrusion of the tongue. I couldn't appreciate any fibrillation of the tongue. Uh, could you, can I have a glass of water? Sure. Assume. Could you please take a sip and hold it in your mouth and Whenever I say yes, just swallow it. Okay? Could you please swallow it now? I couldn't appreciate any swelling that moves on deglutition. I couldn't appreciate any puckering of the skin or pre table mix it in my patient. Uh, on inspection, I couldn't appreciate any discharge, any redness, any scars, any sinus, any swelling uh, in the anterior aspect of the neck. The trachea seems to be central injection. Uh, Mr. Vishal, now I will be touching you for the purpose of examination. If there is any discomfort at any point, tell me yes. Tell me I will stop the examination. Is that okay? Can I have a glass of water? Could you please again take a sip and then hold it in your mouth and whenever I say yes, could you please follow it? Could you please follow it? I couldn't appreciate any swelling that moves on deglutition. I couldn't appreciate any localized rise in temperature. I will be touching the pity. I couldn't appreciate any swelling <coughs> in the anterior aspect of the thyroid gland. The trachea seems to be... I am really sorry. Are you okay? The trachea seems to be central in position. I could appreciate the carotid pul pulsation in the normal anatomical, an anatomical position. Now I will be going behind you Mr. Vishal. Is that okay? Could you please look backwards and look towards the ceiling. I couldn't appreciate any proptosis, any exophthalmus. Now I'll be touching you. Okay. I couldn't appreciate any swelling in the anterior aspect of the neck. Could you please bend forwards? Thank you. I couldn't appreciate any submental, submandibular, any pre-auricular, post-auricular, or occipital group of lymph nodes. Could you please turn towards your left side? Thank you. Let's see. I couldn't appreciate any anterior or posterior group of cervical lymph nodes on the right side. I couldn't appreciate any anterior or posterior group of lymph nodes on the left side. Uh, Mr. Vishal, now I will be gently tapping you. Oh, sorry. Ideally, I should have uh, looked for the supraclavicular and infraclavicular group of lymph nodes. Could you please, uh, now I will be gently tapping you, is that okay? I couldn't appreciate any dullness on percussion, on sternal percussion. Now I will be listening to your neck, is that okay? Can I have a stethoscope? Diaphragm of the 
the stethoscope. Will you please hold your breath for a few seconds. I couldn't appreciate any thyroid treatment. Now we can breathe it. Thank you, Mr. Vishal. Uh, you have been very cooperative. Now we can dress up. Ideally, I will complete my examination by looking for the sleeping pulse rate, uh, examining the cardiovascular system and also the reflexes. You should look for the eye signs. In the front, eye signs. Could you please follow the tip of my finger without moving your eyes? Okay? Without moving your head. Sorry. <laughs> Lid lag. This is lid lag. And case test. Case test. You know about it in clinical examination class in diploma station. Okay. More about it. Now it will be a negative finding in thyroid. Could you please follow the tip of my finger without moving your head? Whenever you see double vision, just let me know. You see any double vision? My patient doesn't have any lid lag or ophthalmoplegia. Thank, thank you, Mr. Chakravarti. Anybody else? 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 Anyb